Hi, everyone. I'm Bill Pito, and welcome to the latest edition of Pito's Points here on MSGNetworks.com. So the Rangers go west. Arizona, the second worst team in the league. The Rangers score six. Then they play Colorado, the worst team in the league, and the Rangers score six again. Chris Kreider, a great game against Colorado on Saturday. A hat trick, his second career hat trick. And when Kreider is going well, he's getting that big body in front of the net, and that was the key to his hat trick against the Avalanche. That area is kind of feast or famine. Um, I mean, you want to get there, take the goalie's eyes away. A lot of times it doesn't hit you, but it you know, creates a chance, makes it makes it harder on the goaltender. Uh, sometimes it hits you and it drops there. Sometimes it hits you pretty pretty, uh, pretty good and, and knocks you down for a couple seconds, but occasionally they glance off and go in. Kreider and his line mates, Matt Zuccarello and Derek Stepan, have been on fire of late, combining for 27 points in the last six games. And it's a good thing. The Rangers have been without Pavel Bushnevich, They've been without Mika Zibanejad, and they've been without Rick Nash. So they've needed this trio to step up, and they really have come through. And the Rangers lately have been explosive on offense. Also of note, coming out of that game against Colorado, career win number 390 for Henrik Lundqvist. That is the most ever for a European-born goal. It's Dominic Hasek, a guy I know who you watched growing up and probably idolized. Uh, how's the significance with that? You know, he, he was such a big inspiration to me. Uh, growing up, I had posters of him on the wall to uh, watch him play, uh, highlights. Uh, I try things I saw him do on the ice, so big inspiration. The way he played the, the, the game, the way he competed. Um, so to first time and then break his record, uh, uh, it means a lot to me. Looking ahead now for the Rangers, they're going to host Buffalo on Tuesday night. Coverage begins on MSG at 6.30. They're at Philadelphia on Wednesday. That game's on NBCSN. No MSG coverage at all. And then the showdown at Columbus on Saturday, 6.30 on MSG2. And we'll see. Columbus has been one of the hottest teams in the history of the league. They're, of course, coached by the former Ranger coach, John Tortorella. He's kind of loosened the reins on them a little bit. They're playing more freer. They're playing with a lot of passion and it's going to be one heck of a game on Saturday night. All right, now let's take a look at some of the best from the MSG 150 from the past week. In the AHL, the Cleveland Monsters, Jamie Cyphers has lost the wheel, he's lost a blade, and he's in big trouble in the middle of the ice trying to kill a penalty. So Marcus Hanekine is going to come in and say, get, a, get off the ice. Get off, I'm going to give you a push, and he still can't get there. Ovechkin, other issues, power outage in his neighborhood. Evgeny Kuznetsov, his teammate, had to get the ladder and get Ovechkin over the gate so he could get to the game. Kiss Cam yesterday in the Slovak fan. And he's not going for the girl. He's going for the beer. He kissed the beer. Mike Palmatier stops Thomas Holmstrom. Palmatier's so old, he's 62, he played against Ron Duguay. And got to help him up. Remember to keep following me on Twitter at Bill Pito, P-I-D-T-O, and keep checking out Pito's points right here on MSGNetwork.com.